What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Fallout 4, episode... What is this episode? 7. That's what episode this is. We're going back in it. Last episode, which is me battling the Myrler Queen, and it was a... So it was a short episode for you guys, but a long episode for me. So, you know, in that episode, there's a whole explanation at the beginning of the video explaining why that video is only 12 minutes long. Uh, you just watch that and you'll understand. But this one's going to be back to the old roots, about 25, 30 minutes. We're going to do it. Nick, we're back, buddy. Hey, I got the music playing. This is nice. Yeah, this big ugly bitch right here gave me hell. Absolute hell. Jesus, this we're gonna we're gonna build up this castle here, and it's gonna be it's gonna be cool. Oh shit! Uh, go away! Get out of my castle, losers! All right, so let's take a look at our quest here. We're going to Diamond City, but buddy boys, that's where we're going. I told myself I'd never walk back into that blasted city after that episode of the journey to the castle, but we're going back because we gotta find Sean. We've done a lot of stuff in the Minutemen. We got a lot. We got, we got our name out there in the Commonwealth for right now, you know, in a small little community. Now it's time to focus back on the main objective here, getting our son back. He's probably at Diamond City. Mama Murphy said that's the jewel of the Commonwealth. That's what you know. That's where everybody goes. That's the big you know hangout spot. That's the Times Square of New York. So he's most likely there. That's where we're gonna go. Do that. Let's just uh, swim, Nick. Swim, swim, Michael. F oh no, he could get up on the. Okay, Michael Phelps in the house. We need some rat away immediately. We almost we're almost at half radiation. Alright, we need to be careful around here. Aw, oh, super mutant camp. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's stir away from this building right here. Let's head in right here. Can we get in like this? Yes, we can. Ugh, no. Can I not let me through? Okay, we can't go in that way. How about right here? Yeah, alright. Rat, rat away? Please? No? We got bottle caps. I just need some fucking rat away, man. Okay, yeah, we're starting away from that building. Because there's super mutants there. Um. Okay. No rat away in this building. Hey! Ow! You hurt! Take this! That just gave us even more radiation. Oh my god. We're gonna be a ghoul by the end. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh, this is the death of us. We gotta run. We gotta run, guys. No, no, no. Okay, new tip. Stay away from that building. Oh, oh shit. I'm sorry. Run, Nick. Don't worry guys, in time, all of these things are going to start fearing us. We're just scared of them right now because we're a bit low. Oh shit, you're fast. I didn't know you were still going to be on me. Okay, okay. That didn't work. Time out, time out, time out. Yeah, get it dog. Oh no. Now you're going to get me. Burn. Burn. Anyone else want to burn? Well, you can't because I'm out of ammo. Ooh. 
Who are you? Oh, it's Preston. Hey, is there something you need? I want to trade a few things. Of course. You got anything on you? I want his hat. Anything else? No, nothing. Okay. okay. Me and me and Preston are gonna switch outfits here. Uh, Preston. There's a big lobster right there. Preston. Preston. Sure. And you always get yourself in these frickin' situations. Oh no, not us! Hit Preston! Keep shooting at Preston, it's almost dead. Fucking son of a bitch. Come here, Preston. <laughs> Is there something you need? I want to trade a few things. Sure yeah. Thing. Give me your clothes and your hat. And I'm gonna give you uh those and where I have a hat for you. No one wants to see your hair. Ew. Fuck yeah. This is an ugly Minuteman outfit. Kind of cool though, really. Like with the armor. Hmm. I dig it. Alright, bye Preston. Thanks for the hat. Love you. Put that hat on I gave you. Please help. Shut your mouth. What's going on here? Please. You gotta help me. This guy's a synth and he's gonna kill me and replace me and my family. Oh God, my kids. Don't you dare bring them up. He's the synth and he wants to replace me. Please, please, you gotta believe me. You can't let that thing do this. Hey, I'm on your side. I just need you to tell me the truth. Then maybe I can help. I'm telling you, Fuck. I'm not a synth. You have to believe me. This is none of my business, guys. I don't, uh. This is none of my business. No, you can't. He's gonna kill me. It's done. We should get going. Synth component. It was a synth. So, we did the right thing, kind of. Preston disliked it, but the synth died. So, we did the right thing. Fuck. We're not far, guys. We can do it. No, go away. Diamond City. Hey, dude. There's a raider behind me. Watch out for her. Oh, shit. Yeah, get him. We made it, guys. What do you mean you can't open Diamond the City. Stop playing around, Danny. I'm standing out in the open here for crying out loud. I got orders not to let you in, Miss Piper. Sorry. Why not? I'm just doing my job. Ooh, just doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. <gasps> I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. Ugh. 
You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> Hello. You. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy. You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month. <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to Crazy Myrna about losing out on all the supply? Jeez. All right. I need to make it personal. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. Heck yeah. You first. Wouldn't have it any other way. Yep. All right. Piper, who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Oh. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. Um... What newspaper are you talking about? Mine. Public occurrences. And we're the hard look at the truth. So are you with us or not? Uh. This is not my business, bro. This really isn't any of my business. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Ah. Welcome to the great green jewel right. of the Commonwealth. Safe. Happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? Sounds great. I'm sure your city's a great place. <laughs> yeah, greatest house of cards in the Commonwealth. Until the wind blows. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? Yeah, um... Just looking for something. Oh, uh, what is it you're looking for? My son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? Uh, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. Well, sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Oh, I'm sorry, I don't have time for any more questions. I'm a busy man. Enjoy Darn. your stay in our fair city. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates anything? I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Right. <laughs> Mmm, a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. You feel honored yet? Sure. Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, um, stop by my office later. I have an idea for an article you'd be perfect for. Ooh, that's a... <laughs> Didn't sound like you were talking about an article. This man. Nick, Nick used to be a married man, alright? You need to... See if we can find someone who can help us out. How about you, man? Puts on quite a show, huh? Yes, she does. Quite a show. Hate it when they bring up the Institute. Ain't like folks aren't already scared of them. The who? Anyway, don't let it get to you. Life here is still a hell of a lot safer than out there in the Commonwealth. The Institute? What's the Institute? Ever heard of the Boogeyman? Shadowy monster that takes people in the night? Well. 
That's the Institute. But they're just a fact of life around here. Someone gets taken by the Institute, or gets killed by a raider. Which is worse. At least inside these walls, you don't have to worry about the raider. So what brings you to the Great Green Jewel? Looking for someone who's gone missing. Gone missing? Who is it? Friend? Relative? Uh, it's my son. My son was kidnapped. His name is Sean. Your boy's gone missing? That's terrible. I'm afraid missing people don't get found in Diamond City. What? God seems to have turned a blind eye to them. And with all the fear what? of the Institute in people's hearts, they've turned a blind eye as well. Help me, man. I'm lost, Pastor. I need help. Please. Well, yes. I don't want to get your hopes up. But there is someone who might be able to help. Nick Valentine. He's a detective. Okay. Saved a lot of lives over the years, but so many more stay missing. And trouble has a habit of sticking to him. Thank you. Thanks. I'll go talk to him. Take care of yourself now. Piper, you're back. Let's be her little sister. Does anyone fight back? Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean the railroad? That's a fairy tale. No. They don't exist. Now, I heard from my cousin. He knows a guy that works for him. They got a code phrase and everything. Follow the freedom trail. The hell is that supposed to mean? You're full of it, and that Ooh. kind of talk is going to get you snatched up by the synths. Follow the freedom trail. Okay. Forever. Huh? Hello, ma'am. I'm looking for the Just detective. Well, Something wrong? Another stray coming in from the rain. Rage are too late. Office is closed. Damn, this is important though. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You don't get it. The detective, he's gone. Missing. I could help. Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. <sighs> Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Skinny Malone. Who's this Skinny Malone character? I don't know much about him, but he's from Good Neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. Okay. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. We're gonna go get Nick the detective back. To spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please, hurry. All right. We got this. We're gonna find Nick Valentine. Let's do it. Also, we'll learn a bit more about that freedom trail. That sounded interesting. Because if the Institute's the big enemy around here, apparently that's the Institute's enemy. Maybe we could get a we could get in with the the railroad, see what they're all about. Not join them, but Don't you know. move, Sam. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a sin. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family! What the hell? Put the gun down now! He's a sin! He'll kill us all! Oh Kyle, shit! No! Okay, show's over. There are no sins in Diamond City. Hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. God damn. something going on here they won't dispatch any security for missing people the mayor won't talk about it and there's no sense in Diamond City and one man who even said there was a sense just got his head blown off
Okay. Now, let's see here. Data. Um. Amber Nathy Farm. Let's go. Amber Nathy Farm's up there. So we're gonna fast travel to the Red Rocket Station. Anything around it I could get? No? Okay. Boom! One shot. One kill. Whoa! This place got a big radio. A radio tower? A radio tower. Let's see what's up. Hey, dude. That's close enough, stranger. We're a peaceful farm. We don't want any trouble. It's okay. I'm friendly. Not looking to cause any trouble. If you say so, but be warned, we're armed here, so don't try anything. Let me tell you, farming ain't easy. Out in the field all day, every day, and every minute of it, spent watching your back. Sounds like hard work. Farming's hard work. Won't argue with that. Blake Abernathy, you new to the Commonwealth? Yeah. I'm... yeah. You could say that. Good to see a new face. How about you? Ever think about work in the land? Don't know. Never really thought about it. Hell, neither did I. I was born into it. Word of advice, though. If you do start up a farm, be ready to deal with the raiders. Why do all the hard work when you can just take what you want at gunpoint? Yeah, I hate them too, bro. Bastards. All of them. Last time those raiders hit us, my daughter Mary tried to stand up to him. Now she's buried out back of the house. <gasps> Only 21 years old, and they shot her down without a thought. That's why we need the Minutemen back. And the sooner, the better. Minutemen? So you know them then? You mean Preston Garvey's Any idea Garvey's why they haven't been around so much lately? Most gave their lives to protect the Commonwealth. That's a damn shame. Those were brave men and women. They'd been here when those raiders hit us. My daughter Mary might still be alive. I don't have much to offer, but those raiders that killed Mary, they took her locket too. It's been in Connie's family for generations. If you could get it back, it'd mean a lot to us. Don't worry. I'll get that locket back for you. Good. All right. Connie feels like it's a part of Mary. I don't think she'll rest easy again as long as it's gone. Let's go get that locket back. New here? Well, if you've got anything worth trading, you can talk to me. I'm good. Okay. How far are the raiders? Oh, they're up there. Um, we're going to fast travel to there. And go show him what's up. Hello. There's no one here. Oh, I guess I gotta go in there. Okay. Who's got the locket? Oh, down here. Let's go. Who? Oh, who's got the lock? Oh. Ooh, a terminal. Let's unlock it. Lock it. Try it again. Needed. Agree? Yes. Boom.
Ah, oh, we got it open. I saw a dog. Let's check this shit out. A fucking mini nuke? Hell yeah. Nuka Cola. Sorry, dude. Gotta step over here. Okay, what's in this? Hell yeah. Hey, call it a mine. Gold watch. Oh, is that the locket? <laughs> um, I'll take the pipe pistol. That sound sounded good. Thing here, bottle caps. Bottle caps in there. Search this desk. More bottle caps. A wooden spoon. You gotta take the wooden spoon. All right, nice. Okay. What the? It's not the man. It's nothing, doggy. Dun dun. Dun dun. over here the bathroom thing in the toilet nope nope what the fuck was that nothing Fuck down. Handcuffs? Hell yeah. It's called bandana, it's kinda cool. Check up over nothing. Good morning. Ah oh, shit. <coughs> she has a minigun. But she's dead. Shit. Any more of you? Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. That. She got fucking minigun. Act Jack. That must be their uh, leader. The locket. We got it. Boom, guys. We did it. Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here now. Hello. I've got that locket back for you. You serious? That's great news. Connie's gonna be speechless. Whatever She's right there. You, need, you can count on us. We got a decent workshop. And Connie's sure to go leaner on her prices after what you've done. Beautiful. So now we got Abernathy Farm under the Minutemen. Nice. That's more people added to our cause. Uh, we leveled up, so let's go ahead and get that done. Okay. Um. So, our persuasion has not been too good so what do we do to is that charisma convince others it affects your subscribe persuade yeah so we're gonna upgrade that so we've had a lot of persuasion attempts that have failed so we're gonna update the charisma so we <laughs> nick will talk to you now he's got it all right so turn that around all right so we we went to diamond city we got all that done we um we talked to the pastor um, he told us to go to Nick Valentine. Nick Valentine's missing, taken by Skinny Malone and his gang. And we're going to go and we're going to get Nick Valentine back in the next episode. As for this episode, this is where it's going to end. I mean, we came to Abernathy Farm. We cleared out their raiders, got the locket back for their, you know, um, their late daughter. It's good. We got them under our belt in the Minutemen. Um, so in the next episode, we're going to go, we're going to save Nick Valentine, and we're going to build up the castle. We're going to put some walls up. 
and uh, you know lights and maybe some tur uh, defense turrets and stuff like that. But yeah, this episode is going to end here. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share this video with your friends, share my other videos with your friends, share my channel in general to tell you help me out the best. And uh, thank you guys for watching.